Libra, I love you too. You guys are so awesome. I haven't posted a video in forever for you guys, and I felt really bad about that, believe me. But when I post a video and I get views like that, best believe I'm following up with another one real quick, okay? So let's get into it. We're going to do a Celtic cross spread for you guys, and we're going to add some other oracles to it as well. Let's get started for Libra. Freaking love you guys. Thank you. If there's ever been a sign that's been truly drawn to me, it's absolutely Libra. Yeah. I'm <laughs> speaking some facts right there. And Aquarius and Cappies. Well, more so Saggy Cappy Cuspers. But let's see what we got. Current energy for Libra. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Tower. Movement of swords. Woo, somebody feels the need to talk ill about you to a lot of people and they feel like they need to do it really fast. Why? Who did you mirror and piss off so badly from? Yeah, you did. Somebody doesn't know what to do. So it's like they're just going to try everything. Ooh, somebody's really trying to be sneaky here. Are you trying to get away with something? I doubt it. You're Libra. What's in the foundation of this? Give me a who or a how they're related. Like, what's the connection? Eight of Cups, you've already walked away. You've already walked away from this person. There is no relation. Nine of Pentacles, exactly, independence. You've walked away, you've called your power back. You don't have anything to do with this person anymore. Why, what, what happened? Yeah, exactly, recent past, what happened? <laughs> happened recent past please between Libra and this sneaky sneaky energy six of swords nine of wands heart of cups oh shit this person could have been your catalyst Meaning someone you thought was meant to come into your life only to do great harm and really put you in your heart. Needing to gather up a lot in order to move forward. Because when the world knocks you down like this, the bitch just keeps spinning anyways. She doesn't care how hard it is for you to get back up. This person puts you through a lot and it was hard to push through. I almost feel like somebody set you up or tried to. You're still hanging in there. I like how the nine of wands, like all the other decks, it's somebody that is, can barely stand up. They're basically leaning on like a staff, right? Um, they've got like this banged up, broken ass fence that they're trying to fix right now. And it's, they're hurt. They're hurt. They are tired. Um, and some of the decks, they've got marks on their body. Like, you can tell this person's been through freaking war, man. War. And you pull this deck where you're just chilling. <laughs> you're just hanging out. Because you're being protected. You see how you're being led and guided? And you're also being protected. Look at this protection. Look at this protection. Do you remember the game... Oh, I wonder if it's this way, right? The spaceship? What game was that? That was my absolute fucking favorite. I want to say Galactica, but I don't know. I don't know if that's it. There was a battleship, like the warship. 
Some of y'all might be thinking of Space Invaders with that. <laughs> oh, let me just put the nerd back in the box. What's crowning for Libra? Yeah, that independence. That independence. Knowing your worth and value also. Something about giving credit where credit is due. I feel like whoever this is, it's almost like the universe is going to force them to put some respect in your name or shut up. Listen, Libra, I don't know exactly who your spiritual team is, but I'm going to tell you right now, they do not play with you. And they do not just brush it off when somebody tries to pull something like this. They're not going to just let this go. Somebody will have to answer for that. I heard the team. It could be the team. So it could be multiple people that have to answer for this. What's in the near future? I am very curious. Probably a little more than I should. I'm feeling a little nosy about it, to be honest with you. But yeah, let's find out. Near future for Libra. Hermit. The Six of Pentacles. And the Heart of Wands. I feel like you just continue to stay um, separated from this person, uh, your energy pulled back from this person. You're aware, okay? Like you're looking at it, you can see what's going on, but you know that soon enough something else is going to be coming into your um, Are we back to distraction energy here? I feel like something is coming in and someone is trying to... You could have done a lot of self-healing, a lot of self-work, and somebody is trying to use the Uno reverse card here, basically, and say that they're the ones that have done all this work. And It's like they're trying to um, flip the script. That's what it's called, flip the script. Um, or project, same damn difference. But I'm also getting, somebody could have tried to like, like there's a reason they wanted to swap places with you, but what is it considered when they try to do that? That's soul swapping. That's destiny swapping. That's, you can't do that. With healing like this comes blessings and a lot of hard work, right? But you're the one that did that work. You're the one that, pulled away from the distractions, the things that numbed the hurt, and you addressed the hurt head on, and you worked through it, you pushed through it. And when you called on certain people to be there for you, all they did was stick their foot out and watch you fall on your face. Did they help you up? No, they laughed at you, pulled out their phones and recorded that shit, probably posted it, right? Like it's fishy behavior. And then we have the Queen of Wands coming out. This person is it's almost like a danger to themselves. What the fuck? This ain't normal. This isn't right. Like I feel like somebody's trying to put it all on you, but you weren't there. You didn't do that. You weren't a part of that. They're, it's almost like prove it. 
prove it. Damn. Fear's worries, concerns. The moon. That's just obvious. We fear what we don't know. But someone is scared. I think somebody realizes you really are psychic. You really are a medium. You really are intuitive. And it scares them. Because they know that you're not lying. Maybe they thought you were faking it. Yeah. Now they're scared. They don't know how to approach you. So they're just like... Why would they even want to approach you, though? That's what's got me confused about this reading. You pulled away, and for darn good reason. I can see why. This person's not healthy. They're not okay. They need help. But they're trying to put it all on you and get everybody else to ostracize you. The only thing that happens is hermit mode, which, interestingly enough, here is the hermit. But what is created under pressure, Libra? Diamonds. Diamonds are created under pressure. And who's going to complain about a diamond? People are going to look like them, look at them like there's something wrong. You complain about diamonds? Who does that? Why are you complaining about diamonds? They could have got you pearls. Would that have been any better? Wow, and that's how the divine is viewing this. You're like, it doesn't make sense because this person's got... qualified for this <laughs> I'm not a therapist I'm not qualified for this they need professional help honestly hell no it might be worse than that well this just got really awkward Magician sideways, I mean, that's, that's, that's sending some not good things to somebody. Uh, it could have something to do with your throat, your heart, because all of a sudden I feel the need to, like, pay attention to that area on my body. The magician, the three of cups, and the king of pentacles. This person could be trying to stop anybody from caring about you, anybody from listening to you, anybody from hearing you out, anybody from uh, taking your side, anybody from wanting anything to do with you. This is somebody that's really trying to drag your name. This is somebody that might even be claiming that you're doing black magic on them. Do they know that talking all this shit is black magic? While you're over here minding your fucking business? Sorry. This person needs more than help. This person might need an ass kicking. Sorry. <laughs> True healing is not learning to only be light. It's learning to love your darkness too. <laughs> and my shadow's got a lot to say about this, this person. Stop. We don't need to use the cuss words. It's getting crazy. Yeah, you guys are seeing the raw side of me. Ooh, that only people that know me personally are used to. Innocence, a cut. You're innocent, bro. You're innocent. This person is broken. Broken. And they are looking for someone to be their um, oppressor. <sighs> to be their villain. You have to be the villain so they can be the victim. Because they just can't stand the fact that you really are the victim. But what makes you the victim? Them trying to make you out to be a villain. Do you see where I'm going? Like, they literally started, created, and tried to complete an entire smear campaign. And you literally had nothing to do with it. I feel like somebody's going to bring it up to you and you're going to be like, what? And these are people that know you, so they know that you definitely didn't say that because there's no way you would have been so confused. Like, they had to explain everything to you. You didn't know anything about anything that was rumored. You can tell when somebody's playing stupid. And these people know you, so believe me, they can tell if you're... And you're not playing stupid because you really didn't know. 
The problem is somebody else, not you. Here comes the Queen of Pentacles to face the devil himself. We've all heard that phrase, hell hath no fury, like a mother scorned. I was going to say a woman scorned, but this is the mommy energy. Somebody, yeah, no, it's your guides, man. It's your spirit team. Buffalo spirit coming through to face the devil for you. Somebody fucked all the way up. Three of wands and the two of swords. What comes next in the potential outcome? What you can see into the future, what you can feel, what you can sense before it ever happens Somebody realizes that they made a really bad mistake. This is a halt. This is slamming the brakes. Stop. Be kind. Please rewind. What? Replay. Or don't. Like, this person screwed up. And I feel like they've been told time and time again. Like, they had every chance to stop. When they decided to call the first person and tell them all this stuff they could have stopped there but they didn't they chose to take it further and call somebody else and then bring up another conversation about you and then go to work and talk shit about you over there and then seven of wands and i'm literally hearing uh what's it taylor swift um it's me hi i'm the problem it's me <laughs> At tea time, everybody agrees. I feel like you're not the first person that they've gone on a, a smear campaign with. Like, they've done this to other people, too. Just not this extreme. Like, they are really, really, really riled up. Their feathers are fluffed. <laughs> and not in a good way. Seven of Wands. I don't know what happened here. But I'm glad that you pulled away, Libra, because this person is just... You're no good, you're no good, you're no good. Baby, you're no good. I'm gonna say it again. Seven of Wands and Nine of Swords. I don't think people realize just how much evil incarnate really walks this fucking realm. Whoever you're dealing with, how do I say it without like freaking some people out? Not every human being that you know is actually human. Some of them are tainted with chaos what's up mamas you want to come up here the old makers yes I know you've gotten pretty big I don't know if you'll fit in my lap anymore it's funny I'm looking at a raccoon she is the size of a fucking raccoon this cat is huge um I am. I'm getting some chaos magic. I'm getting some uh, death magic, actually. I'm getting some really evil shit coming off of this person. I don't know if they have just allowed all these other entities to wine and dine with them at that tea time or what. This... I don't think this person is even a person anymore. I think that person left the vessel long ago and there's something else conducting this shit. I know that sounds crazy, but I'm telling you, whoever the fuck you're dealing with is just pure satanic fucking evil. Um, oh my gosh. Something's tapping my leg. Your hounds might want to go clean some shit up. Let them go. Let them go. I 
there's something else with this person. I just can't put my finger on it. And honestly, I don't know if I want to. It's like Joker from the new Batman series. Some people just want to watch the world burn. I've said it before, the reason that phrase is like took off and that became such a moment in the movie is because it's facts. We don't want to talk about it so nobody brings it up, nobody talks about it, but that's real shit. Some people really do just want to see the world fucking burn, bro. And they're coming in. Somebody wants to burn your world down. Somebody wants to tear your shit up. Like a 75 pound dog and a one inch tree, man. Gone. We have Earth Mother. High Priestess and Ten of Pentacles? Your team has had you from the beginning. I feel like this is carried over from lifetimes. And somebody just is so disconnected. It is literally dangerous to everyone around them. This is a walking, talking red flag. 